Hello and welcome to today's October 19th Second Stimulus Check Update and Second Stimulus Package Update. Now, uh, I am in a hotel. We went to visit our nephew who turned one, so happy birthday, Axel. But, but I know that many of you come to my channel every single day and I haven't done an update in two days and so I wanted to be here for my community. So let's jump right in. On today's video, I'm gonna talk about how President Trump said in an interview that if a bill were put in front of him, he would sign it today. Nancy Pelosi gives Congress and the White House until the end of Tuesday tomorrow to get a deal done if something is going to happen before the election. And Mitch McConnell and the Senate push to do standalone bills for unemployed people, businesses and schools. Let's go ahead and get into this. Now, if you're a subscribed member of my community, then welcome back. And if you're not, consider subscribing right now. Okay, now I don't want to get anybody's hopes up, so there's no clickbait. I'm not going to be overly excited, but this could be the week that we actually get something done. Uh, President Trump is on board to get something done. The Senate is on board, but don't want a huge packet and the Democrats are definitely on board, but they have high demands, uh, according to Republican countersources, right? And so, of course, uh, each, blame, each party continues to blame the others, right? Um, Mitch McConnell wrote a letter to his party, and Nancy Pelosi wrote a letter to her party. Now, they do an awful lot of writing when shouldn't they just be writing the bill and getting this thing done? All right, now, uh, I apologize for being dressed down. I just, I broke away from my family for a few minutes to be here for you guys. I'm wearing a hat because uh, the only thing messier than my hair is our government leaders, right? So, okay, now, uh, going back to President Trump, he has said in several interviews that the White House is ready to do a deal and that he will do whatever it takes to get enough Republicans on board to get a deal passed. Now remember, in the Senate that is controlled by Republicans, they don't have to have every Republican on board in order to get a deal. Uh, they just need to have enough. And so President Trump says he could whip those votes together in order to get this to pass. He also squarely puts the blame on Nancy Pelosi for playing political games with people's lives instead of getting this deal done, okay? Now, I'm just, I'm just telling you what is being said. I'm not giving any kind of opinion here. Uh, Pelosi is saying, no, it's the White House and the Republicans. So again, it's just the, it's just the blame game that we've been seeing for several months now. Now, Pelosi has said that we have to get a bill done this week, right? Now, she, as of right now, from what I've researched, she has not put together any kind of a deal where she comes off of that $2.2 trillion number. So she's saying, here's the deadline in order to get this done, but I'm not going to budge on the dollar amount. And she's saying, this isn't about money. It's about language in the contract. Well, it's obviously about money, but there could be some things about the language, right? Now, this is what was scary to me is Nancy Pelosi said that if we don't get a deal done by Tuesday night, nothing's going to happen before the election. And, you know, I, I've kind of known this. I think you guys in the community have known this. The, the thing she said that scared me was that if, if they don't get a deal done, then they're basically, there's not going to be a deal until February of 2021. Now, I'm not sure that Nancy's aware of the fact that Congress and the, the House of Representatives still work in the month of November. They still work in the month of December. A new Congress will come in that could work in January and also in February. So I don't know why she is saying that if they don't get a deal done Tuesday, no one's, it's likely that no one will get any money until February. Um, so I'm not sure if this is a threat or a decoy, or um, you know, just really strong language. But either way, I just want to let my community know that that is what she has said. Uh, now, to counter that, President Trump said, if I am reelected, I will get a stimulus done right away, right after the election, 
and I will not wait until next year. I will get that deal done. So the two, the two parties are kind of throwing their cards on the table, right? Saying, we both want to get a deal done, but after the election, it could move fast or slow depending on, on who is elected. Um, so anyway, th this is the information that's coming out. Now, Mitch McConnell said that on Tuesday and Wednesday, they will be discussing these standalone bills for unemployment, schools, and PPP funding for small businesses, along with some testing and, and a few other uh, smaller bills. But that will be this Tuesday and this Wednesday. But the, the, the deal for 2.2 or 1.8, or if they can come to some kind of agreement, uh, Nancy Pelosi is saying her cutoff date is Tuesday evening, and she, or she's not talking about it anymore, or that it won't happen before the election. So this is kind of where we're at. Uh, each party is putting out um, their deadlines and, and their focus. Um, and so I just wanted to come on here. I didn't want to go uh, 96 hours without giving you guys an update because I just know so many of you come to this channel uh, specifically for this. Now, as I know more, I will share more. Uh, but I do know this. I do know that if you're watching this, you are amazing. And please do not forget that. Just in case nobody else tells you today, you are amazing. Hey, I really appreciate you being in my community. As I know more, I will share more. Otherwise, I will see you on the next video.